Your stomach churns around and around. The bile within is unsettled. Each moment brings a new surge. Your companions sleep like blissful lumps of meat. She came all the way to this world just to die here. You could do so much better, milady. I am but an eager messenger from the depths of your dirty thoughts. Your clever mind is penning tragedy as we speak. Your repressed urge yearns to kill. And kill you will. Tonight, the moment you close your eyes, your favorite person will be brutalized. sweet words were said in the hope of lying with her. <laughs> A fine performance. Oh, my itching liege. She is only using you. Don't you know that? <gasps> you are wrong to consider another your equal. It is my duty to ensure you are making the right decisions, Master. There was much uh, disappointment at your reluctance to kill the little Moon Maiden. You could kill this one deliberately. I'm sure it will be considered a great show of goodwill. The tithe could still be yours. I do not doubt you will act with a decorum befitting one of your rank. Good night, sweet lady. Your companion rests blissfully without a fear in the world. As soon as you raise the dagger, all doubts disappear from your mind. Replaced by pure pleasure. This is far more thrilling than your nights together ever could be. In the heat of the night, those last gasps are those of disappointment. With almost no struggle, she has gone out like a light. Thoughts flittering. You prepare to be hated. <sighs> Regrettably, the corpse before you is not your only company on this dark night. Footsteps approach. Not your butler come to celebrate this splendid deed. But the others, woken by your happy laughter, or the sound of knife on bone. You've spilled blood in our camp before. This will be the last time. Really? They seem so strong. Just like any of us. Thank you for taking care of them, but... God, what a mess. A reprobate liar. 
But what's one more darling sin on the pile? You are holding on to your allies by but a hair. I know you have your personal demons to contend with. But if I didn't make it clear before, I think you can beat this. Just don't give in. And seek help if you need it. I see the hunger in your eyes. And I see how it worries you. It worries me too. But you are stronger than the hunger. You can resist. You will resist. I'm sure of it. What happened? About your affliction. I know you're sorry. And I know you're probably afraid it'll happen again. I'll look after myself. You look after you. If we each do our part, we'll both be all right. Glad to see we all made it through the night intact. A promising sign that we may be able to curb those urges of yours. Now, as the saying goes, what's left undone should be left unspoken. Is there some lighter subject you wish to discuss? I have been watching you more closely than ever since the night we were forced to restrain you. I believe you have your urges under control for now, and that you may become the master of them. But if you so much as think about harming me, I will pluck the thought from your mind, and then your heart from your chest. That is all. Your kill of your poor friend can only mean one thing. The degraded Scleritas will be back soon enough. No! Don't be sad, Master. I am here to give you a happy present. <laughs> oh, my crumbs of doubt in you were most unjust. You killed your darling, Ankar. A part of your past is here for you. I come with your disgusting prize. Oh, soon enough everyone in the Sword Coast and beyond will know about you. But you yearn for the sordid scandal deep down, don't you? Come closer, my depraved prodigy. <sighs> ah, try on your new gin jams. They're a present from father. It would be rude not to. Such a strapping young behemoth. <laughs> you cannot speak, but you have command over your own cruelty. Oh, yes. Please, wondrous manslaughterer, kill me. Oh. Ah, that was so refreshing. Thank you. Your clothes hit like a kiss. is the Slayer. You will do many naughty feats with it. Oh, I wish I had time to wax your hide and brush your spines. But your adoring butler must away. But you should be hopeful for your bright future. You are going to kill again soon. You will keep chopping down the Moon Maiden's family tree. 
I shall return when you next have need of me. I have your estate to attend to. We will meet again there. Good night, sweet master. Anything I can do for you, consider it most enthusiastically done. Honestly, I didn't know you had it in you. A dark destroyer in our midst. It's certainly one of the more unsightly shapeshiftings I've seen, but we can't all be blessed with the elegance of an Asimar transforming in the heavens, can we? Beggars can't be choosers. Such a powerful form should serve us well in the chaos to come. Well, my day just improved. Did you want something? You and I have markedly different ideas of what amounts to a gift. 